Yo, what's good, guys? Welcome back to Grimlord. I took me a little break from this game because uh, my whole body was just sore after that. Not my entire body, just my arms, my shoulders, my back, you know, the, the lower back muscles, and, and all that junk like that. And this game gives you quite a workout, and it's very impressive. So, you didn't miss much. Uh, I had to cut a little bit of the of this video out because uh, I had a malfunction with the camera, and I had no idea that that was happening. But luckily, it fixed itself during the video, so uh, and when I cut out, you wouldn't miss much. It was just a simple get through the castle, kill all the you know, all the enemies and stuff like that. So, And I had to work these elevators to try to get up to the top so I could open up the big-ass iron door over there just to exceed. There's a really cool boss at the end of this level. I'm a tad disappointed that this boss wasn't as strong or fast. Well, actually, he was fast. But he was so predictable. But he was still a really cool boss, and I think if, and I think if for a player who doesn't know exactly how to, you know, fight bosses in a soul style, they would probably get their ass whooped. But eh, he, oh, he was a real fun boss, cool boss indeed. In fact, he looked like a dollar tree, fucking Dark Souls. Oh, <laughs> oh my gosh, that joke. Well, I hope you enjoy. Take them all one at a time, huh? Two, two, one, two. Actually, that's two. Next. Maybe I can throw them off. Whoa, wow. Fuck you, skeleton! Right in the pelvis! Oh. Alright! What? Ah. Motherfucker hit me! Felt not too bad. Open this up. Now we can go down there and fight him. Oh man, I can't hit as hard from the fucking soreness still. I can still feel it. Whoa, a Superman punch! Broke your ass. And bison. One good hit. Right in the ass. Ooh. Do, 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 do. If they don't have that great sword I like, I won't even fuck with it. This looks like a boss fight. Well, I'll assume we'll know when we get in. Here we go. Whoa! The Dark Knights of Gwyn? Whoa! Okay. You look like the Dark Knights of Gwyn. What the fuck? My souls! Is 
health bar is going a little too slow for me. Fuck! Bring the lower back, bitch. I'm barely doing shit to him. I mean, I'm hurting him, yeah. Oh, the left is not a good hit for me. Oh, he's changing up his style. Okay. I like that. There we go. He scared me. Whoa! 
Whoa, shit. Okay, my health is okay. Oh! Just stunned. Now's the chance. Punch him in the balls. Balls. You are a woman. And. Ah! Ooh, my helmet is covered in sweat. What do we have here? Beautiful sword. We did it! What a workout after that fish I ate. There's nothing up here? Huh. It's not. That was fun. That was a good fight. He was actually one... He, no, not to sound cocky or anything like that, but he's actually, he was actually quite easy when you get his pattern. That's a little disappointing about these bosses. They have, I mean, like Dark Souls, they have a pattern. They have a pattern to them, and if you could get it just right, you can basically not get hit. But these in VR, these guys' patterns is really readable. And I get it, VR games are not easy for most people, so I, I understand why they would, uh, why they would put you know, cues of when he's about to do his move. I don't have a problem opening these chests. There we go. Hanging out. I'm pretty sure this was a short video considering the fact this area was short. That was an incredible boss. The design looked cool. Gave me that Dark Knight from freaking Dark Souls. You guys know what I'm talking about. So... He actually kind of looked like the Dragger, or is that the right name? Dragor? 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 Yeah, from like Skyrim, the ones that wear the old Norse helmets. Look like, he kind of looked like that too. Hmm. But yeah, I'll see you guys next time.